What's up gamers, GamerDad here. This is a guide to help you complete the Dragon Ball warm-up quest, collect the Nimbus Cloud or the Kamehameha in different matches. So you need to do this in five different matches. So the key for this one is to find a Capsule Corp capsule. That is because within one of these capsules, there is always the Nimbus Cloud or the Kamehameha. You can also go to the Kami house and buy this from the NPC Balma. However, that's going to cost you a lot of gold. So I recommend this strategy to do it for free. So after one minute has expired from dropping off the battle bus, the storm countdown clock begins. Check the map. It will show you the Capsule Corp capsule locations. And then you can just head over there to whichever location you want. Pick up the um, either the Nimbus Cloud or the Kamehameha. And then... You have to just do this in four more subsequent matches. So it's basically the same strategy each time you start a match. Hang out in the air. Wait till you see where those Capsule Corp capsules are on the map. And just remember, you need to wait until their official storm counter starts counting down. And then you can just follow them through the sky. And once they've landed, you'll know where they are based on the orange beam of light. Now, from my experience... They land in the most annoying places. For example, this one actually landed under the water and had to be extracted by jumping and, you know, going underwater and engaging it there. Um, and again, you can see here, this one landed on a cliffside, so I had to get creative. I had to get myself uh, some building materials here. And then basically, I have to build up to this one. You know, it was a bit tricky to get to it. Hoped it would work there. But again, just keep repeating the process. And as mentioned, you can buy these from um, Balma on the small island. I have a video on how to locate Balma if you haven't already found them. But that's going to cost you 250 gold bars for every time you buy one. I guess you could also find one on the ground that a player has dropped who's already picked it up. But I don't know, that just seems fluky and random to me. I like to just go at a challenge, have a strategy, and get it done. So that is our fourth one. Now this is the last one here. So hope the guide's helpful. Hope you complete this quest easily. Please drop a like on the video. Please leave me a comment. And if you haven't done so already, please do subscribe to my channel. I really appreciate the support. Have a great day. And until the next video, this is GamerDad, out.